Hello. Uh, this is a quick demonstration of how to apply a vignette to a photo. Um, the reason you might want to do that is that, uh, as you can see along the top here, it's quite bright. And applying a vignette will basically focus uh, the eye on the actual object you're interested in, in this case, uh, a bird. So what we'll do is we pick the background, we click on the live filters, and you have the option vignette. Okay, you've got four sliders. First one's exposure. If you pull it down, it will get darker. And if you pull it up, it will get brighter in the corners. Um, don't normally do that, but there are cases where that, that is actually useful. So what I'll do is I'll bring the exposure down um, just so the, and a little bit more than you'd normally have, just so you can see it. And on the hardness, if I pull it in, you'll see the edge getting softer and softer. And if I pull it out to the right, it will get harder and harder, almost to a, a solid line. So that, that would be unusual to use that option. So we'll bring the hardness down. Now, once you've done that, you've then got scale and basically how big is the vignette. So if I bring it to the left, it will get smaller. And if I bring it to the right, it'll move out to the edges. And once you've got there, the three main ones, you have got shape as well. So it's, it's basically a circular shape to begin with. And as you pull it in, it will get more and more elliptical in shape. Um, not used that much, but you, you might bring it down a little tiny bit. Um, but generally, we leave that alone. Uh, and you balance these three sliders here mainly to uh, give you the amount of um, um, vignette to your image. So basically, I'm going to bring the hardness down. Um, I'm going to bring the scale in just a little bit. And I think that's quite nice. So I just hit the X. Now, what you can do also is with the uh, vignette layer selected is change the opacity. So if you want to make it a little bit lighter, you can, almost to the point of removing it. That's one thing you can do. And another thing is, um, because it's a live filter, this is also a mask. It's already dark down the bottom here. So what I might want to do is pick up my paintbrush, pick, pick black. Um, I'll reduce the hardness is zero anyway. I'll reduce the flow a little bit. And what I can do is, is um, remove the vignette from this area here, where I actually, I still want the bird um, actually seen at uh, full brightness. So now that's um, left the vignette across the top, and I've reduced it, not completely, um, but I have reduced the area around the bottom there. Thank you very much.